So today we're going to stay on a barge in London. <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> you chads, welcome to the vlog. <laughs> Found the canal. Gonna go see George and Delia. Kick some grub. No, that's not it. One after, I think. No, that's, that's it. it. Is it? Yeah. All aboard. Hello. Hey. Did you hear us? Oh, Come bitch. in. I just said you there. <laughs> Attack. Ah! Oh. <laughs> no, you made it. Hello. So yeah. different to last time. The boat or the location? No, the boat. Everything. Really? Both. So different. Uh, and both, yeah, the location's pretty we different. We painted it, yeah. You haven't seen it painted. Mm. Mm. Smells good. Uh, get out of here. Yeah, get out. Hello, Dan. Shower. Oh, yeah. yeah. Shoes, shoes, shoes over there. there. Possum. Huh? That's true. How are you? Uh, are you recording on this? Huh? Yeah. So, oh, good to see you. Hello, hello. So impressed by the shower. Did you, like, did you do it all yourself? You? Yeah. So much better than before, right? That's cool as well. Used to be so shit. <laughs> I'm gonna film it. Yeah, Look at this shower, everyone. Yeah. We're on a barge and it's got full on like glass thing. Deli oh, and George did it all themselves. Amazing. I have to take your shoes off in here. What's your. It's starting again now. Six, seven. Jesus is ready. The car is a bit weird, right? It's because of the blueberries. It will be good, it will be good. Okay, let's try it. Ah, yeah. So this is what's in this? So that is mango, yeah, kiwi, mm. kale, and blueberries. I don't want to use. That was the first That's time. Really That's really good. Good? That's good. That was like the first time we got water. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I love this place. Today's vlog is nomadic living. We're on George and Delia's barge. I mean, van life's cool, but this is even cooler, to be honest. Oh. Finally feels like summer, and what better day to spend life on a barge. Look at it, in the middle of central London. We're going on an adventure to the space next to us. You're strong enough for that? Yeah, it's very strong. You do look like you're struggling a bit. Putting us in! My good friends George and Delia have been living on a barge for over a year and a half now. They bought the barge and have just been travelling around London. I think the rules of the canals are that you, you have to move every two weeks, so you can't stay moored in one place, otherwise they'll fine you. Alternatively, you can like pay to get a mooring, but they're really expensive in London. So my mates are doing a kind of just travelling around, finding different mooring spots up north in Hackney Marshes to out west in Oxbridge but it's a pretty cool way to live. So we're actually by King's Cross station at the moment which is like 40 minutes from where I live out in Hertfordshire. I've always been a bit worried about the disconnect from being able to kind of escape to like nature but ever since my friends have got a narrow bike it kind of feels like a really nice alternative to living in central London, being able to kind of escape to nature and 
just the beautiful outdoors, I guess. The best, oh, thing. That was a week after. the best thing about living on a bar. Are you are you recording? Yep. You've been recording when I've been licking my fingers. Yep. What's the best thing about living in a bar? Isn't it? Um, life in, on the canal, away from other things. It feels a lot more relaxing mm. than living in central London, but being in London. Yeah, yeah, I think that's a good answer. What about like the freedom to be around? Mm. Yeah. Also, to like go to different places and get to know them. So like, it's kind of like moving house or to a new area. And then you get to know the whole area. But yeah, the independence, you know? Being in London, owning your own place. Mm. Have you got any gre regrets? No regrets. <laughs> <laughs> What's the worst thing that's happened? Nothing major. The worst thing that's happened? Yeah, sinking. Wasn't yeah, it? when it was in a sink. Oh yeah, when we were in the sink. <laughs> it was yeah. literally sinking. Yeah, well, the water was like gushing in. in. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the lair. So here's a little storage area. Yeah. And all the electrics. That's not too fun. Storage. And also a little food cupboard. Cool. And storage and a washing machine. Oh, the washing machine's there? Yeah. Didn't really. Yeah. But I didn't even realise you had a washing machine. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you'll have to show yourself the bathroom. Okay. Because I can't do The bathroom. And the shower. When you come in. Tell us about the shower. The shower's fun because we did it. You made the shower. We made a shower. It looks um, like a normal, well, not normal, like a really nice. Yeah, like it's a little bit thinner than normal. You do this as well? Yeah, this is cool because we found this in a bin. Oh, wow. It's like old flooring. So, so that cool. went pretty well there. Subway tile as well. <laughs> <laughs> then the kitchen is pretty standard. We've got a, we got a new fridge last year, which is pretty fun. You can freeze everything and yeah. fridge everything. But cupboards. We actually have loads of cupboards in this boat. Then the window's amazing. Like in the summertime, this is great for obvious reasons. And I haven't seen any other boats with windows. Dining area. Yeah, and the table folds out for any other guests. You know very the beast. Well. And the sofa folds out. To like a massive bed. And we have a little storage space here, it's like our wardrobe. Oh yeah. And loads of stuff gets chucked in there. And a wood burner. Which is amazing yeah. in the winter. Does it use much wood? No, not really. I think in the first year we had the boat, we weren't as good. But now we've got much better at using it. Yeah. So we can like keep it on. Stop flirting, you two. There's a little door here for some privacy. Oh, yeah. It's also good in the winter. I love how it fix, fits underneath. Yeah. I'll go on the bed. That's... Yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> when it's very cold, like this year it was, yeah. we sleep on the sofa. With the heater. And you can like close this door so it's like a smaller space to heat. Oh, okay. The lover's nest here. The lover's nest. The two lovers are nesting. Yeah. Just oh, you cut us! Lover. And then it's almost over, to be honest. Surfboard's up there, there's storage under the bed, which is really nice. And then this is the conservatory. Which right now is full of plants, but can be a nice place to hang out. But mostly it's just a storage area, which is pretty handy, to be honest. Charlie. Thank you, Charlie. Mm. Yeah, and then you've got a book bookshelf up there. Does the pretty lady come with the boat? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the end of the vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. Bit of nomadic living, alternative living spaces. Might try and do more of this kind of stuff. Um, yeah, it's just a, an interesting look into other people's lives and how they live. Hopefully, see you soon. There'll be more exciting vlogs on the way, I'm sure. Yeah, thanks to George and Delia for letting me film around the, the boat. For those people who are interested in alternative living spaces, 
yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, especially if you don't want to pay the extortionate rent prices in London. It's um, it's a good way to live. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you soon.